<laughs> Meat bicycle! Hello everybody! Welcome to a brand new series of Borderlands 2. Uh, this one is a little bit different though. I uh, came up with this the other day while testing a modded uh, shield out uh, made by Ethel. It's called the uh, Whiskey Tango Foxtrot Supply Drop. Uh, you guys have probably seen it. Uh, if I'm clever enough to upload it before, actually, uh, it might be a good idea to upload it before uploading this one. Uh, but basically, it's a uh, modded version of the Neogenator Shield. Uh, sorry, the Whiskey Tango Foxtrot Shield. Uh, but basically, when enemies shoot you, um, you get chances of weapons and gear and items coming out of it. Um, so I thought, why not do? It's not going to be like a full to the end of Overpower 8 playthrough, but why not do just a playthrough of Borderlands 1 with this shield equipped at all times? Um, and I will uh, keep just like upping it uh, so it stays with my level, if you get what I mean. So let me show you. This is the shield right here. So I've got one at level 1 and I've got one at level 5. And for some reason, I put level 9. I think I meant to put level 10 in, but I can always change that. Uh, so if I just go up every five levels um, and just uh, use Gib to just keep upping them, I think that'll be a pretty damn good idea. So let's go ahead and equip that now. Uh, but yeah, basically that is the shield, and uh, when you get shot, it will drop rare, different rarity items. So yeah, out of 20 times, you might get 12, 13 whites, about four greens, two blues, maybe a purple if you're lucky, and then in extreme cases, you do get legendaries from it as well. So uh, I thought maybe for the start um, it should be a good idea that every time a new weapon drops out or a new item um, I just try and pick as many of them up as I can and just keep switching forward and backwards. So if I've got a beastie purple sniper rifle taking on uh, you know, the gauntlet up to a knuckle dragger um, and then suddenly a white pistol pops out I am going to try and pick that white pistol up and use it to, uh, to actually take on knuckle dragger. Uh, I'm also going to allow myself to collect any legendaries that come out and use them if I need to uh, but also see at the end of this playthrough how many legendaries we can actually get from this um, Whiskey Tango Foxtrot supply shield. Um, so I just thought that was a damn good idea and pretty fun. Um, so let's just start off by getting rid of all of these blooming things because um, technically we really should just start from completely fresh and uh, we might have to melee. Uh, at the start. Imagine trying to take on Knuckle Dragger with your fists. Uh, I hope I get something to drop. If not, we might have to come back for them. Uh, but yeah, basically I got it to the point in the storyline where I just come and Knuckle Dragger attack Claptrap because that's when I could actually save it and not start have to start from the beginning. Um, so I just thought that was a pretty good idea really. Uh, it might not last the whole playthrough, uh, but if it does, then I think that'll be pretty cool. Uh, hopefully you guys like the idea and you like the uh, the concept of this. So let's just do a little bit of looting just to make sure not that we need it. See there's a green shield there but I'm not going to use it because I already have my beastie legendary shield. So we've got to go and retrieve Claptrap's eye. Uh, let's get some ammo just in case we do end up getting a weapon quite early on. Um, and yeah basically it's just pick up. It's, I'm not going to be strict strict about oh because you know the, the, when you've been shot by six seven enemies at once uh, you can get two, three, four maybe things fly out at the same time. Um, but where I can, uh, I'm going to try everything can to just hold the E button down, pick up a new weapon and uh, just actually have to use it. So like I said, I could be going against um, an, a big enemy with a purple uh, and then suddenly one flies out and it's a crappy white and I'm going to have to try and use that crappy white to kill that enemy. And like I said, any legendaries that I do get from it, I will uh, just keep and pull out if I need to. So people like, I don't know, the warrior. I'm not going to be able to beat the warrior, I don't think, without a white pistol. Um, sorry, with a white pistol. So that's what I'm going to have to do. Maybe pull out a beastier weapon. Or just maybe I'll uh, change it and just say I'll just keep getting hit by things until a good weapon drops out. So uh, we'll see how it's going to go. But yeah, I could really do with something dropping out. Now is it just bullets? That is the question. Nope, there you go. So you can hear the sound, something's dropping out and it's a grenade so I'm going to have to uh, to use that grenade until I can... Uh... There we go, we've got a weapon finally. We've got a weapon. Right, let's get that equipped. Oh, we've got two weapons actually. Let's use that one first. Is that a blue? That is a blue. See what I mean? It's just a lot of fun. Uh, and I'm just going to have to keep switching it up 
I'm going to get a lot of weapons from these. And it also teaches you, if you've got a really good weapon like this, to try and avoid being shot so nothing else pops out and you have to change it. I just think that's a pretty fun idea, really. I could do with this blue pistol going up to Knuckle Dragger, to be honest. But I doubt that's going to happen. Come on, Clappy. Take your time, mate. Oh, I can't believe I've got a blue SMG already and I'm going to lose it if I'm not careful. Yes, I know. Come on. <coughs> I've got to be really careful here. Uh-oh. Here they come. Quick, don't let me at you. Let's go pull him out if we can. Don't get hit. Don't get hit yet. We need this for Knuckle Dragger. Beautiful. Right, let's go. No more enemies, please. Imagine if I lose it just as he jumps down. Or even while he's fighting me. Uh, I don't need shields. And what will our first legendary be? If we don't get one in this episode, I want you guys in the comments below to guess what our first legendary will be. There's a chance for shields, grenades and weapons to come out. I'm going to be trying to be really smart here as well. And throw a grenade down. Try and kill him without him setting off you never know, he might set off my shield and it might uh, drop a legendary out. It's just absolutely, totally random. Uh oh. Come on, this is nice and easy actually. Yes, there we go. Got a feeling we will lose this weapon very soon though. Uh, we've got a white pistol, or is it? Uh oh. Uh oh, didn't see that coming. Uh oh. No. I don't want to lose this. <laughs> uh, did we get a white pistol drop or was it? You never know, it could have been a hornet. Then again, I don't know if I can, I can't pick it up. I can keep it if it is a hornet, but I don't know if I can use it. Because we're only using weapons that come out of this shield. I didn't see any weapon drop actually. I'm going to check though. If I can find a white pistol, is it worth checking? I don't know. That might be it over there, actually. Yeah, it's just a white pistol. We don't need that crap. Right, come on then, Clappy. Gotta go and see Mr. Hammerlock soon. Obviously, this is quite a steady start to the game, anyway. Um, once we start getting into... Uh, big areas with mobs and stuff I won't keep be keeping the same weapon for so long I'll probably have to change it six seven times I'm just gonna be a nightmare you know full well I'm gonna get a legendary weapon pop out it's gonna be something like a flipping north late I'm gonna be absolutely loving it and then a second later I'm gonna get hit and it's gonna change again but that's the name of the game and this will actually teach me to not be so OP heavy because most of my playthroughs at the minute are like legendary runs and stuff like that where we just use the finest weapons in the game to kill things. This is going to teach me to go up against people like Captain Flint with a white pistol. So uh, it will require a bit, a bit more skill than usual. Unfortunately, I don't really have skill, so I'm screwed. But uh, big thanks to Ethel as well on the uh, community GitHub for making this mod. It's a pretty fantastic mod actually. Um, a lot of fun. And like I said, it's, it's got a. Uh, it's given me an opportunity to do a uh, fresh playthrough, something that I've never really done before, which is RNG weapons and that. I mean, I've seen other YouTubers doing things like Allegiance runs and stuff where they can only use certain manufacturers' weapons and items. 
Um, it's pretty cool really, but I've never uh, never really done it like that. This is uh, kind of a, a way to do that. Right, I wish I had a sniper right now. Uh oh, don't shoot me yet. He's definitely teaching me to be more technical though. There's some bully mongs down there, let's get them out of the way. Uh oh. As soon as you hear that noise, it's game over. Well, not necessarily actually, because it might not be a weapon that come out, it could be a grenade. No, I'm just, just staying up here. No, not having it. I can't believe I'm keeping this weapon for so long. I am being a proper fanny about it though. Easy. <laughs> I don't want to lose my blue weapon. Alright, come on, can't be too reserved. Give me a white pistol then. Everybody's shooting me now. Just too damn good. Shoot me. Maybe not. Maybe we're going to keep this pistol for a long time then. Uh oh. No, that drop didn't drop out of me. Right, I'm going to force myself to change my weapon now, just for the hell of it. Shoot me. Come on, you can do better than that. I think the more damage the enemies cause as well, the more like, there you go, the more likely a weapon is to come out. So, um, like in Overpower 8, oh yeah, this is good. In Overpower 8, it, um, they come out like every couple of seconds. So if you've got like four, four in, oh crap, I like that sniper as well. Shield. Damn it, I wanted that sniper. Oh, what have we got here? Blue grenade. I'll keep that. You try it out. Oh, hello. Huh. That was uh, pretty good. This is so much fun already, just having to give up things. It'd be nice to get to to Boom Boom today. I think we should be able to actually. I might go to uh, to Thingy. Actually, got his name. Midjamong. First and do all the side missions and that. But I know I now have a grenade. I've had quite a few grenades. Them training messages are a bit late. Oh, this is such a horrible weapon. I don't like them at all. I decided to use Gage as well, by the way. I ain't talked about that. Um, just purely because Gage is pretty cool in um, first and second playthrough, I think. It's just cool in all playthroughs, but um, I don't know. I just never really use Gage in videos, so I try and force myself into doing stuff with uh, like that, you know. I seem to always use Salvador or Maya or um, even Zero. So I thought, you know what, let's just use Gage. Plus Death Trap's pretty good when she's um, with something like this where you might have a pistol you're uncomfortable with um, and you just can't get past someone. You can pull out Death Trap and he'll distract him a little bit and help you out. So I think that's the, uh, the best thought uh, I had there. Well... Well, well, well. Let's go. Come on. Time is money, and I've got killing to do with random weapons. Here we go. Ugh, come on. Might sell all the weapons that I've picked up so far. I can't. I ain't got power yet. Duh. Where is he? Are you still faffing around over there? That power 
always on though, isn't it? To your house. Or not? No. Yes it is, he's got his own backup generator. Goodbye everybody so far, don't sell the bloody shields. shield there. Here we go. Two fast travel destinations. There we go. No. Should have turned training messages off. Taps. Um, this town ain't big enough. Right. Clear the graveyard with a crappy pistol. Oh, that actually critted pretty well. Okay, I changed my mind about that. Oh, yes. I can't get back up this way, can I? No. Right. Nice long run all the way around. Got to clear the graveyard as well. Nice, nice, nice. We'll go do that first and then we'll hand them both in. Give. Oh, I may as well hand it in while I'm coming in. Coming past. Don't matter what I get here because I uh, can't use them. Here we go. If you want to hit me, that's fine. coming out just yet like I said the higher level we get the more drops we're going to get because they're going to do big damage to the shield and trigger it and there's going to be more enemies and things like that so it's pretty slow at the minute but this is really quite good actually because it's just a taster and it's letting me just see you know about changing weapons and getting in the habit and stuff so it's not a bad thing okay well we're going to do shield favours hope we can get a new weapon soon even though this one's pretty good. Yeah, I'm going to need to uh, pick up Claptrap, aren't I? There we go. Where are you, sunshine? Got to grab him. Uh, excuse me. Thank you. Come on, then. I'll sell all the weapons as well again, or anything I've picked up. Oh, just one. One and a quarter levels time. I can use my new upgraded shield as well. Here's what's gonna happen, Vault Hunter. My first mate, Boom Boom, is gonna kill ya. Jack's gonna pay us, and I'm gonna play hot. Of course you are, Flynn. Of course you are. Actually, in Southern Shelf Bay, this could be pretty good uh, for hitting me quite a lot. Also, it'll be nice to get to level 5 before I do that, so I have a stronger shield to survive that. Come on then. Oh, I've got to pull it. Right, fair enough. Right, now you're out. I can change that to shielded favours, even though we do not need a shield. Let's trigger that guy off. Shoot me. Here we go, new weapon. Probably not going to get much of a chance to use it. Oh, I didn't auto pick it up. Damn it! I've got to remember. See, I've got to remember to do that. It was that one, wasn't it? No, it was that one. That's a new shield. Oh, it's a TD throw away. Oh, this is bad. This is very bad. New weapon, please, soon. Where did you go? Oh, there we go. Let's get that. Oh, this is going to take so long.
That pistol was so bad. I tried. That's better. Grenades coming out everywhere. Try to reload here, mate. Uh oh. Oh, here we go. No, ha ha. Yeah, I think I might make a rule as well that I don't have to pick the weapon up straight away, maybe. Because, like then, I wanted that weapon, but I was stood right next to the guy. Maybe I should have killed him first and then uh, picked it up. But it's a learning game. Right, well, at least we've got a nice green weapon to go at. I'll probably lose it pretty soon, but... Right, let's get that down. Level up to four, so one more level, and I can do it. I can get my new shield. What is that? I don't know. Like I said, there's going to be times when I actually miss <coughs> that there's a dropout and things like that. I'm not being massively strict over it, but I'm going to try my best to pick up everything I can. See, I can't even see that guy. There's that. There's a guy to my left as well. Where the hell is he? Oh, he's there. Something just popped out of me. It was another. Yeah, more shields. There's one guy over there. Oh, hello. That's blue. Keeping that for a while, hopefully. There we go. Um, that's there. <coughs> Oh, I've got to, uh, got to do the Bullymong ones, well, haven't I? Pick up Bullymong first, I've got to melee him. Right, I might. Oh. I don't expect you to have a blue pistol at by this time. Thank you. Uh oh. One more to do you. Right, I've got to be careful here. Not to get a critical hit. Oh, there's another one coming. Right, let's just go for it. If I can get this guy down. Oh, come on, don't move. There we go, that should be four. One. Yeah, that's four. Right. I know there's one behind me as well. It's not coming at least. Ooh, that was close. That should be one more here. There it is. Blue grenade, blue green shield. Right, we'll go use the elevator. So, return the fur. And then we can go to... Shielded favours. Desperately going to try and keep hold of my blue pistol. But it's going to pull out a white assault rifle. I know it next. I'm really enjoying this already. It's a lot of fun. It's going to get harder as hell though. A cheap one. There we go. Just gonna get a bottle symbol while we're in. Nope, missed it. Not bothered. Right. Let's head back and then uh, we'll go to Southern Shelf Bay and we should nearly be about done, I think. Uh oh, that didn't take long. What we got? Another blue, keeping that. I know something else. Oh, things are flying at me left, right, and centre. Oh, that's no good. I can't get back up. There we go. Green shield just popped out of me. And I'm out of ammo. Oh, didn't think about this one. Um. Ha 
<laughs> Can't do anything more. I suppose I could have switched to my other pistol. No, I can do that one while I'm down here. I've got ammo back now. Just reload that just in case. That is an awful pistol. Oh, I have to give it to you, do I? Oh, of course I do. Yeah. Because uh, you could either give it to Claptrap or Hammerlock. Sorry, Hammerlock. Come on, let's get to this level 5. I'm not going to do today, I don't think, but as soon as I do, I can get a new shield. There go the bats. Right, next one should be over there, but we'll go have this in first, try and keep going as quick as we can. Um, Symbiosis, yeah. I don't think I can switch missions while he's talking. No. Sell, 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 sell. Right. Reach Blackburn Cove, that's fair enough. Let's do this one while we're here. Um, Handsome Jack here. Of course, it's on the roof of his house. Up we go, up we go, up we go. And it's there. Oh yeah, how about this? Lady, I don't even know what to call you. You tell me why you look like you were headbutted a belt sander. Oh, I need some health. I think it's here, the next one, the final one. Mm -mm -mm. Is it melee or is it open? Come on, we ain't got time to stand around. Well, I think we're nearly ready to end, actually. So we'll go hand this in. Wherever it, you hand it in, I can't remember. Um, and then we'll, we'll reach Blackburn Cove, maybe kill a few Bullymongs very quickly and see if we can nearly get to level 5. I don't think we're going to get too far though. I'm right next to you mate. Didn't expect me to be there though, did you? Okay. To Blackburn Cove. We've cleared the way pretty much, so uh, no, we have cleared the whole way, I think, so we should be alright just to run straight there. And I think that'd be a good place to end it, actually. Might chuck a few grenades at some bully mongs. Blow them up. What a lot of fun so far. Next episode, we should be able to easy get to Freons, maybe to, uh, to Sanctuary as well. I'm hoping so. I know the game well enough by now, but uh, obviously it depends on weapons slowing you down. Or or speeding you up. We haven't got a legendary this episode. Will we get one next one? That's the question. It's very possible, but it's also not at the same time. That's the whole beauty of this run. <coughs> right, there we go. Let's go and spawn some Bollymongs in very quickly and just chuck some grenades at them. And uh, hopefully in the next episode we should get to level 5 pretty much straight away. We need to change the mission log as well. Go on, son. Oh, that is not very good against bully mongs. Screw it. Whoa, don't pick up that big one. Calm yourself down, that's it, smaller ones. Aim for the crit spots, save ammo. And I'm out of ammo. Hooray! There we go. Bully the bullies. Uh, so yeah, wow, we're very close to level 5. I might just try and get to level 5 really quickly if I can. Some more bully mongs around here, isn't there? Over there. Oh, I really want to get to level 5 so I can put my new shield on. That'd be a good way to end the episode. 
and I get my skill, my active skill. What at me? No, not that close. Uh oh. Badass bully man. Uh, I need to get ammo quickly. I don't think I saw a single weapon drop out of me then. I was being attacked like hell. Ugh. I might have to fine tune the rules and say that I can use my next weapon if I have to. I don't know. See what you guys think anyway. I'm not going to be able to melee event, um, eventually all the time. Right, look how close we are. Do you know what? We don't even need bully mongs. They're the racks. Let them get a bit closer and then we should be good. Here we go. There we go. Trouble is now they're all coming after me. The hell am I shooting? Huh. Right, there you go guys. Level... Five. So we can now put our level 5 supply drop on, we can also activate death trap and that will do us for the next episode, very nice. So let me know what you think of this um, down in the comments below, if you like the idea of this series, it's uh, like I said it will get picked up soon, we'll get more, uh, more things dropping out of it and stuff like that, but for now thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one.